Hello everyone, Yazid is here and today I bring to you something new. I want to show you my account which is a free to play account. I have been playing first before we start. You need to know a few things about the account. I have been playing from the end of the beta, two months I think before the beta end. And I play around one arena per month. Yeah, I am really do not play arena that lot. I usually just do the quest and play a few per day. As you see, I have 400 arena win. And total win is uh, 3,400. So, I usually I think the average I take in arena is uh, 6 wins. I think I am your average player. As you see, uh, Six of the nine class, I have level 60. Shaman, warrior, and hunter is not. Now, let me show you the, co the card collection I have. Now, I have been playing before the wild, the wild come out. So, I have a decent amount of wild card. I did not disenchant them. <coughs> I almost have every uh, common and rare card in the game, so we will skip in this. And let's go to the epic. So, okay, as you see, I am missing a few, a few of the epic but usually the good epic i have for example ancient floor and <clears throat> because i craft them manually or cabal totem or echo of medieval these are our card i craft them quarter and mysterious challenger forbidding healing layout hand given hand these are the epic i have and i want to show, show them fast to you because uh, I, I know most of you care about the legendary and nine, I it's rarely I craft any epic card most of the time I craft only legendary <coughs> okay so you, you will see that I have most of the viable legendary card except for the new expansion for example I don't have Keen Aviana was not good uh, but on, it, it became good with the new expansion and I am not crafting it for two months because it will be replaced I will put by the way I will point every legendary I craft so I got lucky and I got scenarios and Fendral. King Crush also I got it in the pack. And Tinnitus I crafted. I got this golden legendary today. I craft the Light Lord Dragon Rose and I craft also Tyrion. I all of these I got them in the pack. The Rogue legendary. Oh, these also I got them in the pack. This is my second golden legendary I got. I craft Gulhau, I craft Jiraxus, and I craft Maligos. I got with a uh, fizzle bang in a pack. I craft Gurmash, and these are in the pack. Finley and Blood Mistons and Nut Pigle. Also, these are from the adventure, I, uh, and also the Finley from the adventure actually adventure adventure also this is a, a reward for collecting all the more luck I craft the Harrison Jones and these are from adventure next Ramos and I think no this I got the captain green skin in the pack yeah I got the captain green skin in the pack I craft memory on head 
I know, I know, but I want that Voltron. <laughs> uh, I craft uh, Karen Bloodhoof, especially in, uh, when I started playing. The Karen Blood, Karen Bloodhoof was one of the best six drop in the game. Him and Silvana. Uh, all these all are in a pack. I got them in a pack. I craft the Black Knight. I craft the Silvana and Runner. Adventure pack my third golden legendary and by the way I got three golden legendary from playing from, from the bit I craft uh, Dr. Boom adventure and pack uh, I craft twin emperor and I craft uh, No, this is uh, from Corazan I craft Ragnaros, Alex Straza, Maligus I got it in the pack and the, the rest are from a pack or adventure. Uh, I craft Yusera, I crafted Deathwing, and I craft Nazoth. Now, I want to show you my strategy of uh, doing so. First, I only craft legendary after I open a pack and I have legendary in it. So the chance of getting a duplicate legendary is a lot more slim than other people because I do that and second thing is I destroy golden card as as you see you will not find like I have two copy of a, a common card <coughs> a card and one one copy of a golden because I always destroy the golden card and keep the non golden card to myself when I have extra because it's more valuable dust wise and you will lose in the animation plus <clears throat> this is the golden card which uh, which so when you see this golden card I only I have one copy of Jade Idol and the other one is uh, golden recycle the same and legendary I only have uh, one copy of each so these are cards that I have uh, maybe a zero normal form or a one only as you see and second thing is when I buy a pack I will show you statistic from uh, my um, I mean uh, uh, the, how much from the collection I have as you saw most of the good legendary that is widely used I have except the new legendary which is uh, Kazakas and the Jade legendary because the expansion come out new and I am thinking of crafting them today I, I will destroy the beast and recycle which will give me 3200 dust and craft these two legendary today Okay, so I was telling you that uh, I keep buying because I don't play arena. I keep buying from the last expansion, and I always when a new expansion come out, I stop buying from that expansion and start buying from the new expansion. At that time, I always return to the previous expansion and craft the legendary I am missing. For example, I uh, crafted when the uh, Gadget Zan came out, I crafted the Light Lord Ragnaros, which is a legendary I want, but I did not get. But I know now I will not be buying any more Whisper for the Old God, so I crafted this legendary because I want it. The same maybe if... Uh, Sometimes you, you need to yeah, even thought that I craft few of them before the expansion in example Nazath and Twin Twin Emperor because they were too good to pass out and you cannot play any of the good deck. Doctor Boom I crafted actually uh, when when the expansion came out also. Because you know these legendary are the strongest in the meta. And you cannot play solid deck without them <clears throat> but 
uh, but I was t talking about crafting from not the last uh, expansion from the expansion previous to that because that will lower the amount of getting any duplicate legendary because you are not buying packs from that expansion and by doing so I only got two duplicate legendary uh, in the classic pack I never got any duplicate legendary in any other, uh, other expansion which is part of it luck on my side but the second part is what I am doing and this is usually negate lower the chance of getting any duplicate legendary especially in this expansion now after I got most of the card I need at some point like for the now I am almost got every card I need in the gadget zone I bought around I think 50 pack or, or uh, 45 something around that and I got two legendary so now I will be crafting the legendary that are famous as I told you before get uh, the Kazakas and the Jade legendary maybe the pirate one one legendary I don't I, I am not really sure about this one and I will start maybe playing arena this is the first time that I finish collecting pack really early because I saved 3000 gold before the expansion come out and bought with it 30 pack immediately which is pushed me a lot like a month ahead of uh, of what I am usually around so this was my free to play account I hope you like it and tell me what you, what your thoughts below and this is a really long time if you don't know when the beta is I think a few years ago so it's not like a small amount plus I every time a blizzard nerf a card I just destroy it for example this abusive sergeant or uh, the knife juggler <coughs> or uh, even the big game hunter these are cards that been nerfed recently and I destroy them because of that thank you guys I hope you like the video tell me your thoughts in the comments below and please don't forget that like button it really mean a lot thank you